This is a simple eye makeup using two products. But first of all, I'm going to prepare my skin. Instantly, I'm putting on my moisturizer. This is the Youngblood Hydrolux Moisturizer. I'm going in with the Youngblood Eye Cream as well. So I really like to have my skin nicely prepped. Today, I'm using a sunscreen. This is by Airy Day, and it is the Mineral Mousse. So I'm using this as my sunscreen and also my face primer as well, ensuring that I go down my neck and decolletage. I'm using the Youngblood Mineral Cosmetics. This is the liquid foundation, one of my favorites, and I'm placing this all over my face, right up underneath my eye, all over my eye, making sure that I get um, down my neck, a little bit through over my ears as well, and just all over, just buffing it in with the Ariel Morph brush, down the neck and ears. Now, you can use whatever creamy contour you like. This could be a creamy stick or a contour wand. This is the Emco Beauty. Using the same brush, I'm just pressing this in. So just creating some definition and framing my face a bit and warming it up with this shade. It's really buffing that in. Now, what I'm gonna do is use the same product and I'm placing it on my eyelids. It's very creamy. Getting a small, detailed, fluffy brush, I'm just gonna buff that right out and up right up over that crease and just onto the outer brow bone and this is going to create the base very much like how i've done the contour on my face as well now i'm using a powder contour this is salil by youngblood by all means you can use any products for these two steps please don't get caught up on what products to use something that's nice and natural using the same product i'm now going to set that eye makeup so the contour that I placed on the eyelid, I'm setting it with a nice powder product and again, just buffing it into the crease and up onto the brow bone. You can take any dark shade that you like, but a slightly darker shade than the contour that you've just used. I'm using the Youngblood one from the Weekender palette and this is called Brunchen. So it's quite a dark chocolate color. I'm placing it in the outer corner and using more of a fluffy brush to really diffuse that out once again into the crease and just up onto that brow bone. This is a really simple look and will only take you about five minutes to achieve. Just buffing that in and up in there. Now you can just leave it just like this and add some mascara, nice and simple. So that'll keep it simple. But I could not help myself but use the chocolate chestnut um, eye pencil by Youngblood. I just love running that along the lash line, up into the tight line and a little bit along the bottom lower lash line as well. This just adds instant depth and a bit more weight. And then I'm buffing that out because I don't want any harsh edges. I'd like it to look like a really diffused look. But again, you can skip this step. Remember, we're trying to make this really quick and simple. A sweep of really nice mascara. This is a black mineral one. Just popping that on my lashes, combing through my brows. I'm just leaving them as is. They have been tinted. Just a nice peachy blush. And then I'm popping on a little bit of gloss as well. And that's